today I'm gonna be showing you literally every technique that I know how to catch these sheep's head. First sheep's head of the day. Right under the bridge. Well, first cast, sight fishing sheep's head. <laughs> I just threw my crab right on top of the sheep and he just blitz down to it. Yep. Oh! I got him at the pylon. Yes. Yes. Watch this whole video to the end, and you're definitely gonna learn at least one new technique how to catch these sheep's head. Hey, what's up everyone? Anthony here again, and on today's episode of Coastline Adventures, we're going sheep's head fishing off the kayak, baby, on a beautiful, beautiful winter morning. Guys, today I'm gonna be showing you literally every technique that I know how to catch these sheep's head. I'm gonna be showing you guys bridge fishing, pylon fishing, seawall fishing, sight, sight fishing, deep dropping. Guys, every technique that I know, watch this whole video to the end, and you're definitely gonna learn at least one new technique how to catch these sheep's head. It's gonna be a great day. My goal is to catch at least 10 for today. That's pretty high. All right, let's get after him. Catch some sheep's head, guys. Follow along. All right, so with this early morning low tide, I think my first plan for the day is I'm gonna go straight to my local bridge and try to deep drop some sheep's head. And about an hour to an hour and a half when the tide comes up, I'm gonna head over to my seawalls and docks, see if I can sight fish them there. Either way, it's gonna be a great day catching sheep off the kayak. Let's go get them. All right, so as you can see, we have arrived at the bridge. So let's throw some crabs down and pull up a bridge sheep's head. I got my fiddler crab hooked to the bottom of the butt at the top of the back. fish in the entire world the beautiful sheep's head look at those teeth uh, he won't open his mouth for you guys all right he's a legal size keeper but I'm gonna go ahead and let him go so I'm just out having fun today let's get a nice release on him bye buddy here you go buddy <laughs> wow he was a slow goer all right guys, I've literally been fishing for like five minutes. That was my first couple drops at the bridge. Looks like I'm gonna target the bridge a little bit longer. Yeah, let's keep on fishing, baby. I don't think that's a sheep, no, that's not a sheep. That right there, that's bycatch. Oh, that's a beautiful, beautiful lane snapper. Gonna get him on a release. Bye, buddy. All right, let's drop some more baits down and try to get that sheep set. Fish. Feels like a sheep's head. Yeah. Feels like a sheep's head. Feels like a good one too. Let me show the viewers real quick. Oh, here it goes. Alright guys, so it looks like the sheep's head aren't here. Tides came in quite a bit. So I'm gonna go over to my seawalls and sheep's head docks, see if I can catch some more there. Y'all follow along, let's go catch some more fish. I just crept up on like a whole little family of iguanas. These things are baking in the sun. It's been cold last night, past few nights, so I'm sure they're enjoying this nice sun bath. Look at all these iguanas though, guys. Hey, buddies. Hey, buddies. Whoa! 
almost jumped in the kayak. <laughs> that was funny. All right, guys, so I'm done bridge fishing for the day. I'm gonna head over to my sheep's head spots where I always catch them at. Man, I've only been fishing for a little bit. I got one sheep's head and a few bike catches from the bridge. Let's go catch some more. That was fun doing some early morning bridge sheep head fishing. So now I'm gonna do what I really love, try to get one sight fishing them. Here we go guys, there's a sheep right there. There's a sheep right there guys. I just threw it right on him and he just went down and slurped it. I'm gonna let him run off with it. Here we go. There we go. Get him out. Well, first cast sight fishing sheep head. <laughs> Come here, buddy. Yeah, these things are strong, dude. All right, buddy. There's my first sight fish sheep set for the day. And just like that, literally the first pylon that I looked at got this beautiful juvenile 10 inch sheep's head. Go ahead and let him go. Bye, buddy. Thanks for playing. All right, got one on the bridge, got one sight fishing. Let's see what else I can do. All right, let's see if there's some more sheep's head on the dock. Usually where there's one, there's more. Oh, oh I don't know what that is, dude. A big sheep, big sheep. Hi, I'm sorry. Catching fish on your dock. Yes, ma'am. Oh, it's a good one, guys. This is a good one. Man, he gave me a good first run, too. Oh, he's still running. He's still running. Buddy. Don't let me lose you, please. There he is. Yeah. One more run and he's done. Come up. Uh, no, nope. there you go, buddy. Sure. No. Man, these things do not give up. Come here. Come here, buddy. Come here. Wow. Wow. He does not want to give up. What the heck? No! I lost him. That was a huge sheep's head. Wow, that was a big sheep's head that I just lost. Man, those things don't ever give up. They just fight to the end. Man, all right. Well, I got one sight fish, lost one sight fishing, caught one at the bridge. So the only thing left to do is go do some deep dropping. And other than that, do some sight fishing off the sea walls. Let's go fishing and have some more fun. Oh my God, it's huge. Another big one. Another big one. Come up, buddy. Oh. I'm recording good. Come here, buddy. Oh. Got him in the net. Yes. Yes. All right, guys. So there's, I think this is my third sheep's head of the day right after I lost that big one. I got this one to make up for it. All right, let's go ahead and let him go. Bye, buddy. There he goes. All right, that sheep's head might not have looked good as it was going off. It had a little bit of blood coming out of his gills and I watched it for about five seconds and it did go to the bottom. I was about to scoop it up with my net and take it home to eat, but then right when I was about to scoop it up, it went boom, shot off. It's gonna live fine, guys. Those fish, their blood coagulates and they're fine within minutes. But all right, I already sight fished them, deep dropped and got them on the bridge. And I've been out here for only like 30 minutes. So I'm just gonna see how many I can catch today. Let's keep on getting them. Ugh. 
his bycatch is huge hardhead catfish. <laughs> this is how I used to keep that fish. I'll just go to every dock along the mangrove line and just throw it right on the corner where the tea meets. And if you don't catch anything within two minutes, just move to the next dock. That's very productive. Oh, sheep's head, baby! Yeah! Guys, see, just like that, like I said, go to each dock on the mangrove line, throw it right where the T meets, and there's usually a sheep's head waiting for a crab. Here it is. Sheep's head number uh, four or five. I don't know, man. I'm just out having a time of my life. Sheep's head kayak fishing, bridge fishing, sight fishing, deep dropping, dock fishing. Man, there's so many ways to catch these sheep's head. It's so fun. Go ahead and get a nice release on them. Oh, there he goes. All right, good release, let's catch some more. Now you hook these feather crabs right through the bottom of the butt, through the top of the back. So she beat my crab, set that hook so hard. Ugh. All right, sheep's head fishing. Remember guys, you lose as many as you catch. So right now I'm gonna let the wind slow drift me against this seawall right here, and try to sight this sheep's head. That's my favorite way. Remember what I say, guys? It's a lot of sighting and a little fishing. Oh man, the sheep's head coming for it. Oh, I think I just made too much noise. Oh no, he's going for it. He's going for it. I just threw my crab right on top of the sheep and he just blitzed down to it. Yep. Oh! I got him at the pylons. Yes. Yes. All right. All right. All right. Oh, God, these fish are so strong. Come here, buddy. All right, I got him out of structure. I got him out of structure. He's on the drag. It's a good one. The side fish is a good one. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yeah, there's another technique how to get them, guys. Sight fish them on the seawall. Yes. There it is. I was just standing up, looking on these seawalls, and I seen a sheep's head. After I spooked two of them, this third one, he was willing to play. Man, these fish are so beautiful, guys. I'm out catching and releasing today. He's a legal size one. You're lucky today, buddy. Look at those teeth. All right, let's let them go. Hey buddy. Bye. Yes, it's been a phenomenal day. Sheep's at kayak fishing. I love this. Wow guys, man, sheep's at fishing is so much fun. I think I went through at least five techniques with you guys. How to bridge fish, sight fish, deep drop in, dock fishing. I mean, I really don't know what else I can do. I think I'm up to like uh, six or seven sheep's head. Man, the bag limit if you're gonna keep them is only eight sheep's head over 12 inches. So I definitely would have gotten my limit today and went home with some dinner, but I'm just out catch and release, having fun with my most favorite fish in the world. You guys, keep following along. That's all my techniques for you. Let's catch one more fish. For the last sheep's head, I'm gonna put the GoPro on my head so you can guys get a POV view. Nice size snapper too, it's a legal size. So right there is what you call bycatch. This is a legal size mangrove snapper. I'm gonna go ahead and send him back on his way. Bye buddy. Well, that's gonna be it for today's episode of Coastline Adventures. Man, what a great day. Kayak fishing for sheep's head, my favorite thing in the entire world. It was so much fun. I literally had to utilize every tactic that I've learned in my past five years of sheep's head fishing. Today, I'm glad I got to show you all all the different ways how I target these beautiful fish. Guys, if you like this video, do me a huge, huge favor. Hit that like button and also make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel so you're notified every time I post an exciting video like this. I'm gonna quit talking. I'm gonna get out of here. As always, thanks for watching. 
Come sign adventures out. Till next time. Bye. Thanks for watching.